Hello guys, welcome back to Let's Play Harry Potter and the Chamber of Secrets. So, we are going to Hagrid. So we're going to go and see him. Now this is another sneaky sneaky mission. So we've got to sneak into the Forbidden Forest for this one. And find out information. So we're going to go and see our Hagrid about the... Go and see him about the... Uh, what happened 50 years ago in the Chamber of Secrets. Now this is not going to be an easy one because this is another sneaky sneaky one. So yeah, let's go. Alright, so here we go. Let's go and see little Hagrid. Well, I've got to be very, very careful now because all the prefects are like in and out, in and out, and then that's it, I suppose. So let's go. Right, so there's prefects in and outside of the castle, so let's try and be careful. Wait for him to go. Three hundred and seventy seven. 305 for Gryffindor. Oh god. I'm gonna try and boost up my um house point totals. I don't think we've won the house cup yet, but we are nearing the end of this let's play. So yeah, we're gonna go and see Hagrid first. Right, Hagrid's hut is just through that archway. Hey, you! Uh oh. Shit. I don't want to distract Did anyone him. See him? There's Hagrid's hut. Right, let's go. Turn up the volume a little. Should be all right. Why is the camera like that? Hagrid. Oh, there he is, Hagrid. Oh, Professor Dumbledore. Bad business, Hagrid. A very bad business indeed. Things have gone far enough. As chairman of the school government, I've simply got to ask to send you away. Away? Away to where? No, not the wizard prison. Not Azkaban. I'm afraid, sir. A dreadful thing, Dumbledore. As of this moment, you are suspended. Of course, if anyone wanted to find out some stuff, 
All they have to do would be to follow the spiders. That's the lead them, right? That's the key to the whole thing. And that's all I'm saying. Right, so... Come uh, along now, Hagrid. We don't want to keep the Dementals waiting now, do we? All right, I'm coming. Right, now we've got the key to the Forbidden Forest. So, we are going into the Forbidden Forest to find out some information. So, this is it. This is where we're going to get the creepy side of it now. So, again, like in the movie, um, except for the fact that Harry and Ron went into the Forbidden Forest to follow the spiders. Harry is following the spiders in the game. So here we go, let's go into the Forbidden Forest and follow the spiders. So uh, we're going to go and see what's happening with this and find out the truth about Hagrid's. Right, here we go. Forbidden Forest. Right. Oh no, spiders. I don't like spiders. I really don't like spiders in any form. I'm arachnophobic, so I don't like spiders. I freak out if I see a spider. It's like one of my least favorite horror species. But, you know, I know they're not, they're alright on the screen, on films, I'm alright with them on film, but uh, in real life I don't like them. Incendio! Right, so let's go and see uh, the Hagrid's Incendio! spider friend, Aragog. I need help. Oh, just... Oh, and die. Time. The time is 10.03am. Oh, God. Uh, so, I just check on the time. Right, here we go. Next cutscene. Is it Hagrid? Not exactly, but I'm a friend of Hagrid's. Hagrid has never sent men into our hollow before. Hagrid's in trouble. That's why I've come. In trouble? They think up at the school that Hagrid's been setting a, a something on students. They've taken him to Azkaban. But that was years ago. Everyone thought that I was the monster that dwells in that chamber of secrets. They thought Hagrid had opened the chamber and set me free, which was why he was expelled from Hogwarts. So you didn't come from the Chamber of Secrets? No, I come from a distant land and Hagrid cared for me. A girl who was killed 50 years ago, who was discovered in a bathroom 
and I have not seen any other castle apart from the cupboard I grew up in. If it wasn't you who killed that girl, then what did kill her? We shall not speak of it. I'll just go then. Go? I think not. But, but... I cannot deny my children fresh meat. Oh, no. Now I've got to escape Aragog. It's but I've got to take him, I've got to knock him out as well. So I need to... I need to get the this webbing on fire. I'm trying to remember where I've got to go for this. Oh. Fuck off! Right now. Ah! Oh no, I fell. Shit. Oh shit. I'm gonna try that again now without getting killed. Ah, so I need the one done. All right, let's do that one. Incendio. Don't fall. <laughs> I said don't fall. What do I do? I fall. Oh great! I know what I I know what I'm doing now. Anyway, I know what I'm doing. I gotta get the uh, I gotta get the other web in. <laughs> I believe it's this way. Yeah, it's this way. Let's just go. Oh. This side. Oh. Oh. Good job, it's all cutscenes on this as well. Oh, fuck off. Let's kill him. 
Oh, I love this soundtrack. Ah, no, not again, no. Fucking hell. Oh, this is annoying me. Sure, this is so dark in this game. Right, let's find our dog and take him out. I love this track. He's not dead yet. I've got to defeat him now. I've got to fire, fire, throw some fire at him now and kill him. So I've got to defeat Aragog now. He's not going to be. He's not going to be easy. But right, I've got to dodge his attacks. My health is low as well. Come on then, you fucking...
Ah, good thing you can go back to where you were instead of starting at the very beginning of the battle. Not like that on the uh, the last enemy, because you got oh, it's hard to get the basilisk. Which I'm guessing is going to be the next part of the game, and the last part, I think. Oh my way. film this uh, last cutscene of the day and then I'll end it there then. Uh... Right, so let's do, uh, let's end this now. End the day. Right guys, that's the end of it for me today, hope you enjoyed and I'll see you next time.